Hello, welcome to Shafi Tech. This is Shadrach. Well, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can move a personal account into a brand account. What are the benefits of having a brand account, a YouTube brand account? One, you separate your Gmail account or your Google account from your YouTube account. And I'm going to explain that with a second benefit. The second benefit is you can invite managers to manage your YouTube account. So you can invite someone to take care of your SEO for you. You can invite someone to upload videos for you. I hope you understand. And the second one deeply explains why you should separate your YouTube account from your Google account. You see, when someone is to manage your account for you or your YouTube account for you, the person should not have access to your Google account, whereby allowing the person to access your, your, your Gmail, to access your Google Photos, to access your Google Class, to access your Hangout. No. So if, you have, if your YouTube account is a brand account, the person will be invited to your YouTube account through the person's Gmail. So you just enter the person's Gmail and you invite the person to help manage your YouTube account without you giving your Gmail account or your Gmail account, your Google account to the person. So that is the second benefit. It is good for a brand or a company. So that means you can invite someone, you can invite someone to be as a, a, a CEO, okay, and you can also invite someone to be an editor on your YouTube account. So, what are the disadvantages of of um, having a brand account or moving your personal account to a brand account? Disadvantage number one: you will lose your custom URL. So, it is advised that you 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 delete your custom URL. Then after you move from your custom from your personal account to your brand account, then you reclaim your custom URL again. Yes, that is how it's supposed to be. Or you have to create a new channel and move before, or you have to move to your brand account before making a lot of uploads. Another advantage is you are not going to lose any of your videos. You are not going to lose your likes. So now, before we continue, before you get to the computer, just subscribe to this YouTube channel, okay? If you are new, and give me a thumb up, like this video for me, okay? And also, if you have any question or, or any suggestion, just leave in the comment section. I'll be very glad to answer any question that you ask. So now, let's get to the computer. Can anybody out there hear me? guys so all you have to do is you just have to type youtube on, on in your browser you just open youtube and make sure you have signed in into your youtube account okay so now we are going to check if this youtube account is a personal account or a brand account so we just have to click here you go to your settings so as you can see you see we cannot invite anyone okay you cannot invite any manager so that means this is a personal what account so now let's go to the account my 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 account okay see i have two videos over there so all you have to do is you are going to move ahead and move this personal account into a brand account so just click here click on settings so you click on advanced settings so now as you can see you have moved to a brand account just click on that okay so uh, we need to verify with our um password okay so i have two step authentication so i will have to give a permission okay uh, allow and 75 so i've given them permission so it's good to have two-step authentication on your account to protect your account. So if someone wants to log in into your account, 
and the person will need a permission from your end before they can move okay so now this is it okay so so now this is it um this is the account we need to, we want to uh, move to a brand okay so after you click on that click on learn more so and click on channel list okay okay so now i'm going to create a new account which will be a brand account take note create channel so i'm going to make it test two then mark it and create so this is a brand account okay so click create okay so now we have created a new one which is text two okay so just click here go to settings again but still we have logged in into the youtube boss the one we want to move into brand account take note okay so i'm going to the advanced settings once again then i'm going to move to brand once again so so i'm going to click on the text tube and click replace right so now listen here is the channel that will be deleted which is the text tube the one i created okay so i'll delete this one now listen channel after move so after we remove the channel okay now youtube boss with no subscribers with two videos okay so we are moving this to a brand account so click move channel so your youtube channel has been successfully moved it will take up to 10 minutes for you to see the full result i hope you understand so we are we are going to keep refreshing so we see that our account our brand account has been created successfully so i'm going to go back So I'm going to recheck again and see if uh, it has been moved successfully. So go to settings. So as you can see, channel managers, add or remove managers. That means our YouTube channel is now, YouTube boss is now a brand account. It's now a YouTube brand account. So that is it. So thank you for watching this wonderful YouTube tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe to this YouTube channel. Give a thumbs up if you like this video. Give a comment at the comment section. Okay. See and let's meet next time.